guys, I kind of unofficially decided it's going to be favorites week. Um, I'm going to show you a lot of favorites. The last video was MAC favorite, uh, favorite lipsticks. And this video is going to be about my favorite glosses, high end as well as drugstore. Um, I don't know about you, but I love lip gloss. Um, hopefully you like it as well. I'm going to tell you about my favorite formulas. So it's not so much, I'm going to show you my favorite colors too, some of my favorite colors. Uh, but I'm, I want you to concentrate on the formula brands that are pigmented, easy to wear, and stay put for a decent amount of time. Because I think all of those things are very, very important when it comes to a lip gloss formula, and then you get to the color. And that's, you know, whether you prefer neutrals, whether you prefer colors, or that kind of a thing. But the right formula kind of makes a lipstick range, or lip, to, <laughs> lip gloss range for me. Um, so I'm gonna go back and forth, and a, a couple of these are new, but some of these are tried and true favorites um, that have really stood the test of, uh, the test of time. One of my favorite formulas is the uh, Bare Minerals Moxie. Uh, Marvelous Moxie Lip Glosses. Now this is one of my favorite coral shades. It looks beautiful on deeper skin tones as well as fairer skin tones. This would really be a nice pop of color. Uh, Party Starter, it, Starter is a really, really great shade. Um, the only thing that's different with this as opposed to everything else is this has some tingle to it. It has a nice, it's a comfortable tingle, not a angry, mad, you know, make, you, <laughs> make your lips feel like they're on fire tingle. So it's a decent tingle. I know you're going to be here a lot because you, you tend to do, you, to like lip products. He, he does. If there's a lipstick I'm showing, he's right there. Um, so Party Starter is a great, great shade. It's All, all of these are uh, available. Uh, I'll tell you about the one that isn't that I'm wearing that I love. Uh, but Party Starter is really close to the one I'm wearing. And um, it's a really, really nice, uh, as I said before, kind of a coral shade. So if you don't mind the tingle, I have a ton of these. If you don't mind the tingle, they have a color for you. They have every color available. Um, one of the greats from the drugstore that is kind of newer to me is uh, new NYC New York Color. Their liquid lip to shine range. These are really, really great, easy to wear glosses. The one of the most popular colors is Nude York City, and that's a great nude. Um, this happens to be a little bit more of a favorite of mine. It's called Honey on the Hudson. It's a really, really nice shade. These are, old glosses are so, so inexpensive. They're just a couple bucks. They have a long applicator, so it's kind of a different than a doe foot and uh, this again is honey on the Hudson gorgeous gorgeous nudist shade that I love to wear I, I love the fact that these are just like two bucks and change amazing one of my favorites that I talked about in a recent video uh, I had to bring it out again is Lancome's gloss and love because I really like this formula the uh, formula. This is Fuchsia, Flash and Fuchsia, I believe. It's number 391. Um, they have a kind of a unique system, as most high-end brands kind of fancy it up. You click this button right here, and the top pops up. The applicator does look a little bit different from what I'm seeing. It's more of a cupping shape, which is really nice because when you're putting the gloss, you're really just cupping your lip. It's very, very nice. This color is gorgeous as well. Uh, one of my favorites. I have less... I've, now I have less than half of this. I mean, it's like down to here. I love this stuff. Um, so let me show you the color right there. But remember, there are a lot of different colors. So this is about how great the formula is. All right, now we're off to the drugstore again, right? <laughs> This is one of my favorites of all time, um, my favorite colors as well as a, a favorite formula. This is uh, NYX's Mega, Lip Sh Mega Shine Lip Gloss. Um, this color is everything to me. It's called Sponge Cake. I have two of these. There's one in my purse and you know one in my vanity. Fantastic nude. Sponge Cake can do no wrong when it comes. And Sponge Cake is kind of shimmery, but NYX has a lot of great colors. Uh, I have Cosmo, Pinky Taupe, I believe it is. So Sponge Cake is right on top. Love that color. Um, a lot of these colors I have lip posts for, uh, blog, lip blog posts for, so I will list them in order that I mention them below for you if you want to take a look at those. Ah, uh, back to the high end, uh, <laughs> end of the world. Um, I didn't check right before, but I believe they made this a permanent color. It came out in a collection, but I think it's available. This is a Chanel um, Rouge Allure Extra, Extra? De, de Gloss. Um, it's number 68 True Blonde. And it's one of my favorites. I, there's another one, Merrillville. I go back and forth between it's Merrillville and True Blonde. This is just a great nude shade. Really, really great. Nice applicator. I will swatch it for you. 
I know, Max. I know. There are squirrels, and we usually take. I usually take Max for about an hour each day, or almost an hour, 45 minutes for a walk, and we haven't done it. So he's like, the squirrels are waiting for me. Um, so yeah, it's right there on top. This is such a gorgeous color. Definitely have a lip post for it. Um, I will include it below. Great color, but again, these Rouge Allure, I, I really, it took me a long time to pick up one. I only have two you know, the two that I mentioned, um, but they came out with a great color. I would definitely consider it as pricey as it is because I love the formula. All of these that I showed you, like I said in the beginning, have a really nice payoff, feel so comfortable on the lips and wear well throughout the day. Back at the drugstore, this is a newer one and this is uh, Fuchsia Orchestra. This is one of the L'Oreal uh, Extraordinaires, I believe they are called. Cute, cute packaging. Um, so you got it. I put this one on Instagram too, but you got to take a look at the uh, the lip post for this one. It looks amazing. I have an orange that is great too. I forget the name of it, but yeah, that is Fuchsia Orchestra. And if you like br bright colors, you need this. Fuchsia Orchestra is everything. It's number one oh six, and it just it stands out and it looks great. All right, these, I wish they would make more of these. There are only a couple available that I like. Well, I have the ones. It was one of those situations where I got one and then I got all of the colors I liked, but it only ended up being four colors. Um, and for this brand, uh, Clarins. Um, I'm gonna show you their gloss protégés and I wish they'd make more colors. I'm always on the lookout to make sure I'm not missing anything and they haven't. Um, this is the color Blackberry and there's one color that always stays in my um, purse because it's like my uh, a granite a perfect nudie color uh, but this one is the one is th that's eye-catching and that I've showed these before and people are like no blackberry blackberry is the one I have a post for this as well uh, this color is just really really super on the lips and it is kind of a daring darker color but it still looks very very fancy and good um, so it's right there, Blackberry, and if you look at this close up, you can see why people are just like, yeah, that's special stuff. Blackberry, very, very special stuff. Um, back at the drugstore, these are readily available. You can find these at any drugstore uh, with, that carries Maybelline. Raspberry Reflections, these are the, uh, gosh, Maybelline, um, is it Color Sensational Glosses? I hope that's what they are. Raspberry Reflections is one of my favorite colors. These are just so easy to wear. They, um, everything I have here isn't like offensive smelling. I know a lot of people don't like the NYX gloss smell. Uh, it doesn't really bother me. Uh, but yeah, these, these are just really easy to wear, um, really nice colors. Uh, they're, they, the best colors that they, I have from them are limited edition, which kind of sucks. They make great limited edition colors for the, this uh, range of uh, glosses, which really, again, I think sucks. But that's Raspberry Reflections. It's part of the regular line. Really, really nice plummy kind of a purple. And let's see, uh, this is the one I'm wearing. Uh, it's a matte cream sheen glass, and I was very late to the game trying these. Um, this one came out, it's a limited edition one, but again, just think about the formula. There are a lot, you know, a lot of these, they come out in limited edition collections, and I always check out the colors because I'm so into this formula. Oh, this formula feels great. Um, Meteoric is the color that I picked up. One of the first, the first one that I got into with the uh, he MAC Heavenly Creatures collection. And this color is just everything. This is another one I had to shake it up because there's about a little more than a half of this left. And it's a fantastic, perfect color for me. Everyday kind of wear. Special place in my collection. I can't say enough good things about it. They came out with one um, even more recently. It was a purple cream sheen glass that I got. I think it was called Narcissist or something like that. So amazing. Just the same thing. Great formula. So there it is right there. All right, last but not least, this has a great, great, super great formula. It's at the drugstore, a beautiful range of colors. Um, I have a, well, I think in the last video I wore Lightyear, which is a great nude. This is my favorite bright color that they make, uh, Rimmel Show Off. This is such a great formula. They call it a lip lacquer, so it, it does stay put and almost is like liquid lipstick. Uh, but this color, Big Bang, is everything. Big Bang is super bad. It is just the brightest, most beautiful drugstore gloss red um, that I've ever come across. And that is it right there. Big bang.
wonderful, wonderful, wonderful shade. So guys, definitely, um, if you haven't tried any of these formulas, especially if they're high end, check them out before you buy. Um, and definitely look for the colors you like. I think the formula is something that you're going to enjoy. There were others that I think came really, that come really, really close to having like a formula that is so good it should have been in this lineup. But these are the ones that I reach for um, and the ones I have multiple shades in um, just because the formula is so good. So I thought I'd stick with those. Um, so yeah. It's favorites week. Uh, I think I'm gonna go over bright blushes next because I've had a lot of requests to talk about bright blushes. This is the time of year for them, I think, the fun time of year for things like that. So I think I'm gonna do that next and I hope you'll enjoy that as well. I'll talk to you later and thanks for uh, joining me and Max and I gotta take him out. I gotta take him out. Bye-bye.